Knowing the difference between 32-bit and 64-bit architectures is essential for optimizing system performance, ensuring software compatibility, and future-proofing your computing setup. Let's start with understanding bit size. The bit refers to the size of the data that a CPU can process in one operation. A 32-bit CPU handles 32 bits of data at a time, while a 64-bit CPU handles 64 bits. This difference significantly affects how much memory a system can use and how efficiently it can perform tasks. Next is memory addressing. In other words, 32-bit limitation and 64-bit advantage. Imagine a library with a limited number of bookshelves. A 32-bit system can address up to 4 gigabytes of RAM, similar to having a library with a specific number of shelves that can hold a maximum of 4,000 books. Once all shelves are filled, no more books can be added. A 64-bit system is like a vast library with an almost unlimited number of shelves. It can address up to 18.4 million terabytes of RAM, allowing it to handle much larger datasets and perform more complex tasks. Next, let's look at the data processing angle. Think of data processing like moving boxes. A 32-bit CPU moves boxes one by one, each box containing 32 bits of data. A 64-bit CPU moves larger boxes that contain 64 bits of data, allowing it to process more information in each operation. From the compatibility standpoint, a 64-bit CPU can run both 32-bit and 64-bit applications, similar to how a modern Blu-ray player can play both old DVDs and new Blu-ray discs. However, a 32-bit CPU can only run 32-bit applications. Imagine editing a large video file. A 64-bit system can handle this task more efficiently because it can access more memory and process larger chunks of data at once, similar to having more workers to complete a project faster. For tasks like gaming and video editing, which require handling large amounts of data, a 64-bit system is preferable because it can access more memory and process data more efficiently. Older systems or applications might only be compatible with 32-bit architectures, but most modern software is optimized for 64-bit systems. In summary, 64-bit architectures offer superior performance, larger memory capacity, and better compatibility with modern applications, making them the standard for most computing needs today.